Wow, you guys, I'm about to react to another video. Sadly, it's the view, but we have to love them for the weekly entertainment that they do give us. I need you guys to stick along to the back end of the video to see what I think about it. But right now, I need you guys to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, let me know what to react to. We're about to get right to it. They are never going to find someone that doesn't know about the former twice impeached loser president. Yeah. Okay, so there's uh, Sunny Hosen offering her wonderful opinion of Trump. And uh, we're laughing at it. Fine. Hey, have fun with it. You know? You're uh, uh, you're allowed to say uh, he's terrible and all that, and and I'm allowed to say that your blouse has the same color of a urinary tract infection. Right? No one's no, they're never gonna find that. But what I did find also interesting about my Super Bowl is that um, the legal teams will be checking the jurors' social media profiles to see if they can assess the truthfulness and intention of what they said during voir dire, which is their questioning. Okay, Sunny Hostin, be careful when you talk about checking people's social media because i agree they should be checking it for republicans on the right but also i think they should be checking it for democrats on the left she only assumes that a republican would lie about their profile and i think that's really really important because if you start liking trump say you follow trump stuff on social media are you going to are, can you be impartial can you be impartial if you like uh, someone's social media well I went and visited Sunny's social media to see what she liked on Twitter. And what we find out is she can't be trusted and she's biased. So, she, you know, you should reject her opinion as such. Here's the uh, Republicans against Trump. She reposted this. Republican Senator Mitt Romney on Trump. He is unquestionably mentally unstable. And he's a racist, bigoted, misogynistic, xenophobic, vulgar, blah, blah, blah. He just emptied the whole vocabulary on him. I think he actually had this Twitter probably written for him, Ghostwriter by Liz Cheney or Adam Kinzinger. Okay, here's another uh, post from Sonny Hostin. Such an honor being invited to the White House to discuss the unique positions of the Afro-Latino community in social advocacy and the arts. I'm an artist. Ugh. Thank you for having me. Uh, and there she is. There's pictures of her with all the uh, white, uh, the White House imbeciles trying to destroy America, but shows her bias, her bias, okay? There's Jeffrey Tubin, who is singularly famous for touching himself in public on, in a video conference room meeting. He was probably looking at video of Sonny Host, and so ironic that she would uh, repost him. In oral argument today, Justice Thomas is minimizing the severity of the one sixth insurrection at the Capitol. Blah, 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 blah. Back to Sonny Host and embarrassing yourself. I don't really think so. And I think what could happen in a case like this is if you have someone, and, and we were talking about this morning, someone named Clay Travis is sort of telling people to get onto that jury. I'm with Clay Travis on this one. Get on the jury, my people. Remember, we just now found out they they interviewed the jury people that went and uh, and let OJ off, and they said, "Do you think OJ?" They go, "Of course, the jury. We were all black. We thought that he did it, but we were going to let him go. I mean, he's a black guy, and and you know, systemic racism. So he is allowed to murder his wife, the mother of his children, and nearly behead her." Um, and her boyfriend, of course, he's allowed to do that. They think ends justify the means. So I'm only saying, guys, this has happened for juries all the way back. Democrats love it when they can pack a jury full of bias. And I'm only saying, let's get some Republicans in there because it only takes one. One of us Republicans going, hey, I, Doug, do you hate Trump? Yeah, I hate him. Get me on this jury. And then you hang the jury. You get rid of uh, this jury. If you want to know why Michelle Obama is not being considered for this jury, it's because the prosecution doesn't want a hung jury. Oh. You get one person that sneaks onto that jury with untoward feelings, that person can hang that jury. Yeah, good. Let's, so let's, I hope one of our people are willing to hang this case and demolish the uh, the efforts of this oh here's another one of sunny hostin's reposts on twitter on hung juries uh this is mark lamont hill oj simpson was an abusive liar who abandoned his community long before he killed two people in cold blood 
his acquittal for murder was the correct and necessary result of a racist criminal legal system. So even though he agrees that OJ killed two people in cold blood, his uh, acquittal was necessary because the system was so racist. So that's what Sonny Hostin wrote. Now I'm only gonna say similar to Sonny Hostin and Mark Lamont Hill. The system is so crooked against Republicans, conservatives, and Christians that though Trump might be guilty of what he did to Stormy Daniels, he must be acquitted. You must sneak on that jury and get this case a hung jury, my people, because the ends justify the means, according to the left. And so uh, if they will judge us using that standard, then we must perform the same at them or they'll never learn. It does not stop without it. How do you and sneak onto a jury? You have to be called. Well, you lie. Sorry. You lie. You say, yeah, yeah, that's I okay. hate Trump. I, uh, but I can be impartial right. and I this and that. And then all of a sudden that's the, the. Okay. So to my Republican friend, Sonny Hostin just gave you the plan on what to do. She told you exactly what to do. And uh, I'll let her, I'll leave it with her. That is some good advice. Wow, you guys, that is the view for you. It's cool to disagree and have your own views and opinions. But when you're a complete hypocrite about it, that's when it's honestly wrong. They show sympathy for other people that do way worse things than they think Trump did. The view hosts are trying to do everything they can and say anything they can to get people not to see the truth. Let me know what you guys think about the video in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're new.